right, guys. <laughs> Matt said, <clears throat> Matt said uh, was on something else. So, have uh, hope you guys had a wonderful weekend. You know, there was a, a Memorial Day, which is uh, <clears throat> remembrance of uh, fallen soldiers in America. And yeah, I hope you guys had a uh, you know a good barbecue and uh, remember them and remember the people who actually risked their lives to uh, give you guys the freedom that you guys have right now and much to the world. Alright, so let's get started and uh, <clears throat> oh, no. Alright, let's get started and I'll show you guys what we're talking about today. Okay, so we <clears throat> today we're talking about uh, drop shipping business. Okay, if you guys don't, haven't heard about it, I'll explain to you guys right now. The drop shipping business is basically uh, we're going to go on Amazon <coughs> and we're going to look for products and research that products onto eBay and see if we can make a profit off of it. Okay. Uh, then we're going to list those items onto eBay and when a buyer wins, they're going to pay us via PayPal. PayPal is uh, an on online payment processor and then uh, we're going to get that money transferred to a bank. And it's kind of like a, uh, yes, payment, it's kind of, PayPal is kind of like a bank. But uh, when you first start this business, PayPal is going to hold your money for 21 days. But in the DIAS domination course, uh, we show you guys how to get that money even faster. Okay. As a reseller, then you're going to go to Amazon website and you're going to order that product and have it shipped directly to the buyer. So that's what uh, is called drop shipping because we don't have to worry about the inventory, holding the products, uh, overhead costs, and we just worry about listing the items and uh, Selling them and ordering that products and have it shipped directly to to the, to the customer. Because uh, before you know, uh, when we want to be a reseller or retailer, uh, we have to open up a, a shop, right? We have to open up a store where we have to pay monthly rent and we have to hire employees and then we have to order the inventory and shelve it under the store. When uh, <clears throat> When we were in that business model, there was a lot of competition from the big box store. They pretty much can undercut us, and, and they had a lot more items than us. So you know, put a lot of a lot of uh, us out of business. But with the internet, it completely changed everything around because now we can compete directly with them. Okay, and uh, let's show you guys the two main websites that we work with. We work with Amazon and eBay right here. So we gotta look for uh, products that we can make uh, profit on. Okay, so that's just researching, researching different products, and I'll show you exactly how we do that. Uh, for example, let's go ahead and uh, find. I'm gonna find a word around the house. So mm, I'm still looking. We use a, a lot of words around the house already, but let's go ahead and use a uh, high chair. Okay. I have one here, so let's go ahead and use high chair and we'll start uh, researching these products. As you can see, uh, when we search for this word, there's one almost, uh, uh, it's over 100 dollars in that, uh, items listed, but we want to get those items directly uh, shipped by Amazon. So what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down a little bit and we're going to see this uh, title right here. It says free shipping by Amazon. So we're going to click on this one right here, and then we'll get mostly items that are shipped directly from Amazon, and it'll bring us all results down. So now we move over here on the product screen, on the product product section, and uh, we're going to look for these Prime logo. Uh, these Prime logos are uh, are items that are shipped directly by Amazon. And what we want to look for is we want to look for items over $35 so we get free shipping. So this we get free shipping right here. It says free shipping. But this one is $25.90. We need $35 to get free shipping. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and uh, click on this item and we'll research this right here. Okay, as we can see right here, it's selling for $149. We get free shipping. And this is the pink colors too. And it's sold and shipped. By Amazon, right here. So we're going to copy this title. We we'll move over to eBay, and we're going to paste this title onto eBay, and we'll research this item. So 
So then we're going to look for the same pictures. Okay. So I see that this right here, it has 20 watchers right here. And it's fried so we can make a profit. Okay. Let's go ahead and click on this okay. first. Okay. So I'm in the uh, current listing of this item right here. They have nine available and 12 sold. So let's go ahead and click on the 12 sold. It, this a, it's going to be on in blue. So there's a link to it. So click on that and we're going to get the price that I actually sold for. As you can see, on uh, May 26, it sold for 130. So, this, but the selling price is one uh, 230. So we won't use this. We always use the sold price because we always want to go uh, for the sold price, not the current price. So let's go ahead and go into the left side of the screen right now, <clears throat> and go into the sold listing, sold section of these items. And I'm going to click on this one right here. And now we're in the sold section. As you can see, there's a sole listing section right here. And then the numbers is going to be green. And we're going to scroll down and we're going to look for uh, for one that's sold for a profit. So eBay and PayPal takes away 15% uh, for fees. So we have to figure that into, uh, into uh, the listing. I'm just moving down and I'm going to use uh, this month of May and April uh, to current month. Okay, so I'm looking at this. It's a different uh, product, different picture. It's sold for $189.99. So go, let's go ahead and go back here on Amazon and I'm going to see if I can look for the same picture. Okay, here it is right here. Here's the same item. Right, let me see. Yeah, it's the same item, but it's priced different or different. So, okay, it's one eighty nine ninety nine. Get free shipping. So let's go back and uh, I'll move back around here again. Okay, so we're in, back in March. So we won't use that. Uh, we won't use March. So we'll go back to the uh, the active listing. Okay. So right here, as you can see, we're back in the active listing, and we're just going to scroll down. We're going to scroll down and we're going to look for uh, a price that is uh, higher and uh, if the item is sold, uh, that seller might uh, will get a, a profit. So 130 okay, and let's go ahead and click on this one right here. It has three available. So I'll go back to active listing, none sold. We'll move on to the next one. It's another one from Bay or us, but different color. Yeah, move back and unsold. It was this right here? Then sold. That's a different uh, product. And click on this one. So I'm just researching the for uh, profitable products right now. And then since I'm clicking on these and uh, <laughs> Since I'm clicking on, on all these uh, products and listing right here, and uh, I can't find a proper items, right? So the next step I would do is we're going to click on uh, uh, a high price item right here, and we'll, we'll start researching uh, what other items that this seller is selling. So I'm clicking on this. It might be a different color, different size, right? Uh, what's this one here? Maybe a different item. Oh, it's this item right here. Yeah. So as you see, they're setting themselves up for a profit. Uh, if it's sold by Amazon, so let's go ahead and go to see other items that the seller uh, is selling. I'll click on this, and we're gonna move down, and we're gonna do uh, over, over into the left side. So listing again. Click on that, and we will get a certain results right here. And I see this right here on May 1st. This item sold for $54.95. I'll click on that just so I make sure. So it is sold on May, 4, uh, May 1st for $54.95. So what I'm going to do is we're going to copy this part, this title right here. And we'll move back to Amazon and we'll research this product. I'll paste it on here and press go. And I'll move down. Let's click on this. I think this is the same. 
Fish. No, not the same. Okay, different pictures. Okay, so we'll just move down and we're going to look for this item right here. It is uh, kind of like purplish. Okay, let me, you know, okay, kind of purplish on the right side. Uh, it's this one right here, this item right here. But as you can see, there's no Prime logo. That means it's not shipped by Am from Amazon. So we'll skip this item right here, and we'll go back to the active listing for the seller, and we'll move on. It's April uh, 18th. I'll click on this. So for 69.85, I'll copy this title, and we'll move back to Amazon. Paste this on here. Okay. So we find it right here. I'll, I'll click on this one right here. Hmm. So why? Can I look at the picture. I look at this picture, and it's the same picture. Okay. And then I'm gonna go down here and look at the description too. If I'm not sure, okay. description. And over here, the description is the same. So that means I'm I'm good to go. I'm going to compare these two. Uh, just two items right here. I mean, two one same item, but uh, uh, it's for sale at a different price. So right now, as you can see, this item is selling on Amazon for twenty four ninety nine, but we don't get free shipping. Okay, free shipping needs to be over thirty five dollars, but since I'm figuring out there's a profit to be made even with the shipping cost, then I'm gonna sell this product. And so this is a. Uh, a little bit higher training right here because we have to do an, an extra step. Okay, so let's go ahead and take uh, <clears throat> the cost, and then uh, we'll figure out the shipping charge that Amazon charges. We're going to take the eBay sole price first of sixty-nine dollars and not eighty-eight cents. We're going to multiply that by 0.85. So the reason we multiply that by 0.85 is to get the price after the fees. After eBay and PayPal fees charge about 15%, uh, it's actually, actually less than that, like 13.23, something like that. But we just round up to uh, a higher 15%. Uh, so you know it will cover uh, any other fees or any other any other thing that uh, we might possibly get. Okay, so let's go ahead and take 69.88. We'll fly that by 0.85, and we'll get uh, $59.39. Then we're going to take the same price down here. We're going to move the price down here, the sole price, uh, after fees of uh, $59.39, and we're going to minus the cost on Amazon. So let's go ahead and go figure out the cost. Okay, so what we want to do is we want to add this to a cart. So I'll go, go, ahead, go ahead to click to add to cart and click on uh, proceed to uh, activate my cart and I'm going to click on estimate your shipping and tax okay so as you can see uh, right down here is a estimated guess of the shipping and price yeah. <clears throat> sometimes it's a little bit higher Sometimes less, but in, it's in the general vicinity. Okay, so I'm going to use this one right here, and this uh, tax also too. So let's go ahead and take uh, the cost of uh, thirty-two dollars and eighty-six cents. I'll go back here, and we're going to pull up a calculator again. Minus thirty-two dollars and eighty-six cents. We get twenty six dollars and fifty four cents for a possible profit. So this item I would sell uh, right away. There's a high profit margin, as you can see, it's almost over one hundred percent profit margin. So that's a good item to sell. So this is what basically what we do uh, each and every day. We spend half our out half of our time free time. In this business, to uh, research items, research products, and they had to have listing those on to eBay. And as you can see, uh, this item, the same item, is sold on eBay for a lot higher price than on Amazon. Okay, and 
it's also because of the title too and we help you guys with the title what you want to do is fill up the whole title and then uh, use our uh, title builder in uh, the DS Optimization website to help you with that. Okay, so let's go and go to the next item. Go ahead and go to this item right here. So on April 11 for $99.98, and I'll copy part of the title so we can find this item. And I'll paste it onto Amazon. So I'm looking for a purple-ish car seat right here. And here it is. I see it right here. I'll click on this one right here. Uh, then I'm going to pull up our uh, calculation and uh, calculator again. And we'll figure out this one more time. I'll delete this. Delete. Delete. So we're going to take the eBay sole price of $99.98. Then we're going to multiply that by 0.85. $99.98, multiply that by 0.85, so we get the fries after the fees, $84.98. We'll take the sole fries after the fees, we'll move it down here, and we'll minus the cost. So with this item right here, it's over $35, so we get free shipping, so we don't have to go to you know, add to card and estimate the uh, shipping charge and uh, tax. Okay. So let's go ahead and take uh, fifty-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. So we'll minus that away. Fifty-nine ninety-nine, and we get uh, twenty-four dollars and ninety-nine cents possible profit right there. So yes, pretty much asking why does this uh, item right here sell for a lot more than on Amazon? And yeah, we, it's because that uh, <clears throat> we put this in front of the customer. We have more customer that looks at this product than Amazon because uh, of the title. And then buyers, uh, and not only that, buyers buy uh, products from everywhere. So even though if the title isn't uh, optimized, uh, so we can still able to sell this, these items. Yeah, because you know, you, if you look around the house, uh, have you uh, look around the house and everything you have you bought that you bought, did you buy it at the lowest price? No, because you, know, you haven't done all the research that is needed. Because the time is money. It takes time to research every single item, so that time is spent uh, more on doing other things. So let's go back. And uh, let's go back to Amazon and eBay uh, to the main website, and we're going to use a random word generator this time because you know, we do the show live, and uh, we want to do this this show uh, <clears throat> this the hardest way possible. And even though we we do this the hardest way possible by using the random word generator, we're still able to find probable items. Go ahead and click on this one time today. One. Copy this word and let's go to Amazon. We'll paste it on here. Oh, there's only 18 results, so I'll skip this word. Not a lot of products there. Darky, okay. Let's go have you use Darky. Nope. Nope. No, no products there. A fifth. Let's go ahead and cheat a little bit and use the word fifth only. Okay, as you can see, there's over 400,000 results. And I'm going to go to the right side of the screen, scroll down, and click on free shipping by Amazon. Now we have the results down. And over here on the right side, or the left side, I'm, I'm seeing this books are in this category a lot. So this is a product right here. Let's go ahead and take a look at this product, actually, because we're going to get free shipping. Okay, so it's selling on Amazon for $69.76. We get free shipping, so and ship by Amazon.com. And we're going to copy the title and we'll go back to eBay. We'll paste the title on here. So we'll research this item. 
And we're going to move down on here and go to the soul section right here. Uh, how much is 479? Oh, this actually probably right there already, but I'm going to go and we'll just do that later. <clears throat> 70, 89. So here it is on May 26. So for 80, not, excuse me, 89.95. I'll click on this to make sure it's too slow. I'll click on too slow to get the real price that's so far. Right here it is. On May 16, it's actually sold a little bit more. So we'll bring up a calculator. We'll take $91.95. We'll multiply that by 0.85. And we'll get $78.15. And we'll move back to Amazon right here. And we'll minus a cost of $69.76. So that's $8 profit right there. And the next step. Uh, what we would do is uh, let's go ahead and research uh, uh, what other items that this seller is selling so uh, we can see if we can make a profit on that. Uh, so I'll click on on uh, see other items right here and I'll scroll down and we'll go to uh, sold listing and we'll click on that. And we'll move down and we'll just start clicking on these items. Products and click on sold April 29th for 51.95. Okay, sure. Let's go ahead and copy this uh, title and uh, we'll uh, go back to Amazon. We'll paste this on here. And here it is, right here. It's the same item, same picture. Well, not same picture. It's a use a different picture. So now tip is uh, use the best picture uh, for your listing because uh, usually pretty much 90% of the time. Items uh, sales because of the picture. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull up a calculator and we use 51.95. Multiply that by 0.85. Get 44.15. Move back to Amazon right here and we we'll minus a cost of 39.99 and we get four dollar. And this is exactly where it want to be. We want to make at least a minimum of uh, three dollars per listing. And so this is price right, and we made four dollars. Cool. Oh uh, yeah, because it takes us about four minutes to list one item. So let's go ahead and move back, and we'll start uh, looking for more. Okay, here's a gorilla cart right here. So for one sixty four ninety five, I'll go to click on this uh, the sell section, grab this uh, item. Also, on May 6th, this one is sold for. I'll use this item right here. I'll copy a part of the title. And we'll move back to Amazon and we'll paste this on here. So it doesn't really matter what you uh, copy and paste as long as you're able to find these products, the same product, then it's all good. Okay. So I'll click on this right here. And right here, it's selling on Amazon for $129. If we get free shipping, sold from and uh, ship and sold from Amazon.com. So let's go ahead and figure out a possible profit that we can make for this item. 164.95. We'll fly that by 0.85. Get 140.20. And we'll minus the cost on Amazon is 129. You get $11 in profit right there. So if this seller can sell this item for this price, and uh, that means we can too. There's no, pretty much no difference. So we'll, we'll move down and we'll just look for more. And I'm skipping all these slight low price items right here. Uh, it's because uh, I want to get free shipping by Amazon. Yeah, but oh, it's all of items over thirty-five dollars. So let's go ahead and take a look at this one right here. Uh, May twenty one twenty nine seventeen. Copy part of the title and see if we can find this item. And here it is right here, but there's no prime local right here. So I'll click on it and yep, it's sold by a different company. So we won't use this. But if uh, if I'm looking at these items right here and they're uh, they are selling well around this price, then I can scroll down and I can look at other items. 
and I can possibly think of selling it too. So for our example, let me see if I, I can find an example. For example, this one right here. Uh, so this one right here uh, is a gas. It's an op. Let me see. Yeah, it's a gas upgraded. Yep. Uh, yeah, it's selling for one thirty two. But on eBay, it's selling for one twenty nine. So let's move down. And we're going to take a look at this one right here. So this one right here is on Amazon is selling for 107 get free shipping. So it's kind of the same thing. So I would list that around the same price right there to make a, a, at least a minimum of $3 in profit. Because it's basically yeah, the same thing. It just looks a little different. And I'll move down and I'll look for some more. And of course, there's all the items out here. So we can research each and every one and find out if it's a profit there or not. So let's go ahead and go back and uh, we'll, we'll go to uh, the next item. Or actually, I'll show you how we can research this item too. Uh, okay, so let's go down, let's go down, let's go down. And let's take a look at this burner, this stove right here. And I'm also looking at these uh, reviews right here. If they have a lot of reviews, and uh, <clears throat> that means that the item that sells uh, really well. So I'm hoping that these items sell very well on eBay also. So let's go ahead and click back on eBay, reset myself to the main screen. I'll paste this item on here, and we'll research this item. And so let's go ahead and go to the sold listing, sold section. And we'll scroll down, we'll scroll down, and as you can see, these are have different prices as so far. So we move down how much is for again? Uh fifty dollars. So it needs to be around sixty-five dollars so we can make a profit. So we'll just move down, move down, move down. And here it is right here, I think. Basically the same thing. Um look at the same picture. Let me see. Yeah, was pretty much and then if I want to double check, then I'm gonna move down. And I'm, I'll look at the description. So, yep, it's the same thing. So, I, I would have thought to make and sell this item right here. This is a chance that this sells for this price. So, let's go ahead and take a look at $69. Multiply that by 0.85 to get the price at the fees uh, $58.65. And I'll go back here and I'll minus the cost on Amazon of $49.97. That's $8 in profit right there. And here's the same item, so for a sell for less. So let's move down a little bit, so I know that I can sell for that price. It's a vintage one, that's pretty cool. You have a vintage one, you can sell for a lot more. Okay, so let's go to a different item. I can scroll down here, and then there's a lot more frags right here. And uh, I'm looking at it, it's also the frame logos. Okay, let's go ahead and go to the next page. There's no frame logo there. There's a frame logo right here. Next page, next page. I'm just going through it. So I'm showing you guys uh, a lot of products. Amazon has millions of products, and then there's thousands of products that are coming online each and every day. So this is our uh, our catalog right here, our online catalog, our supplier, where we can use. Uh, and in business, it's about having a product to sell and where to put it. Uh, for it to sell. If you have no products to sell, then then we show you guys how right here. We should I show where you got the, this product right here and where exactly to sell it. So let's go back and let's go back to uh, the search screen again, and we'll use the different products that we were searching on. Let's go ahead and use this uh, movie theater it's a kit right here. We have a lot of reviews. We'll copy the title. And go back to Amazon, I mean eBay. I'll paste it on here, and I will search it. One eighty-four. Okay, well, there's one eighty-four right there. We're in the sole section. As you can see, we're in the sole section listing of this item. Move down. Let's go down. So this item needs to sell over two hundred dollars. So let's move on over to the left side because we we didn't we're not able to find the numbers. And we'll click on 
we click on the sold listing to get to the active listings. And right here, I'm seeing that it's selling for 2695. There's a lot of watchers are watching this product. So I'll click on this and I'll, I'll see if anything have sold. So we have sold right here. I'll click on this uh, three sold and I'll see how much it sold for. So this sell for so for on May uh, a couple of days ago uh, for two sixteen ninety five. So we'll do a little calculation right here. Pull up our handy dandy calculator. It's pretty much our best friend in uh, the business world because everything is has to do with the numbers. So as they say, if the number looks right, then it is probably right. So let's multiply that by point eight five. Get one o four. Point three. Okay, one. Oh, there's no profit here for this item yet, so we have to uh, find a couple more dollars. So one eighteen, one nineteen is what we want to find. I mean two eighteen, two nineteen. So we'll scroll down. And it's another seller selling for two twenty. I'll click on that. Nope, didn't sell yet. There's three available, so we'll just go down the list. No, nope, didn't sell yet. Now we'll move down the list. We'll go down the list. Some offers, but no, didn't sell. It sells, so I'll click on this. That's a while ago on uh, December 8. Okay, so for that price, that's a profit uh, right there, but too long ago, so we won't use that. We just keep going, click on it, click, click, click. click. So all that we're doing in this business is just bringing the inventory over, bringing profitable items over to eBay. And we're bringing over the description and <clears throat> and the product description here yeah, and the features, and that's what we're doing. So uh, just click on a couple more. Okay, I'll, okay, a couple more, a couple more. And sell. So it looks like uh, we're going to be able to sell this item for a profit with right here. So what we're going to do is let's go ahead and go to this, this listing again. And we see that it's selling for a higher price. Let's go ahead and go to uh, see other items that this uh, seller is selling and research other items. And I'll go down here and we'll click on uh, sold listing. And we'll move down, we'll move down. So some fish tank, but too low price. And I see that's on, uh, I'll click on this. This sold for 86.99. I'll click on two sold. So far on May 23rd. Let's go ahead and copy part of this title right here. And we'll go back to Amazon. We'll paste it on here. And here it is right here, but Amazon is not selling this product right here. So we'll go ahead and skip that, and we'll go back to the seller sold items right here, and we'll just keep scrolling down. And let's click on this one right here, two sold, May 22nd. Uh, I'll, I'll copy part of the title. Paste on Amazon, and we'll look for this. Let me see. Okay. I'll click on it. Make sure it's the same item. So I'll click on the picture again. And you have the alternative picture right here too. Okay, so that's what it looks like. I'll go ahead. Here it is right here for uh, thirty-nine fifty-five. So let's go ahead and uh, do our equation. Pull up our hand and calculator. <coughs> Fifty-two. 95, multiply that by 0.85. $45 is uh, the price after fees. And we'll minus the cost of 39.55. And we get $5 right there. Perfect, perfect. So let's go ahead and um, go research other items. I'll move down here and we'll start looking. We'll start looking. Well, what's this thing right here? It's a wild color. Let's go ahead and let me see what we can use. 
limit. I'm just gonna use this canopy right here. So this canopy right here is a sidewall. It's a sidewall for a canopy. And it's down for $81.39. We get free shipping. Now down here it says ship and so by Amazon.com. But at the end of it says it says <clears throat> in easy to open packaging. So what easy to open packaging is is uh, is is not the retail box. So Amazon got this product to break uh, off the retail box and they'll put in their their own box and they'll ship it. So usually what with this uh, have this in your description also, and <clears throat> because uh, a customer you know, usually they want the retail box so that they can. Uh, they sometimes they have more options, so they can gift wrap it and uh, you know, gift it away. So if you want to be uh, you know, do this easier, when you see this, go ahead and skip it. But if you want to sell this, then go ahead and include that into your uh, description. So I want to copy this title and we'll research this item. I reset myself on eBay by clicking on this logo. I'll paste this on here. I'll save this. How much is this for again? Eighty-one dollars and ninety-one dollars. Drop right there and go to sold listing. So we'll move down. We'll scroll down. And we'll price for a higher price. And we didn't find any. So let's go ahead and click on uh, on active listings right here. Start clicking on the items. So this business you can, uh, can be done pretty much anywhere in the world. As I found out, I thought it was uh, if you had a PayPal, an eBay, and bank account in your own country, but pretty much you can do this uh, in any country as long as uh, there are requirements that uh, is met. You know, as long as, of course, you have to have uh, uh, U.S. currency and <coughs> my God, uh, <coughs> and buy. The item on uh, Amazon and have it shipped directly to the uh, the buyer. Uh, so, but I want to say that um, uh, you need eBay. Uh, well, you need. I'll get that. I'll get that. Uh, that straight out later, I guess. But usually, I say you need eBay, uh, PayPal, and a bank account in your own country to. Uh, to be sure that you're able to work this business. Okay, so here it is. Here's uh, 109 90. We'll fly that by 0.85. It goes $93.41. And we'll move back to Amazon right here, minus a cost of $81.39. We got $12 of profit right there. So usually in the show, we uh, usually find around $100 in profit in less than an hour. So let's, let's go ahead and do that. Go ahead and go to sold listing and we'll look for this uh, meat slicer on April 30th, okay, $117.95. I'll reset myself because if I search this, I'll be only searching on the paddle lawn and garden section. <clears throat> so I'm looking for the same item right here. So I'll take this down a little bit. Uh, slicer, meat deli, garmento. I'll click on that and make sure it is what brand is this right here. It's a Nesco, okay. Let's go look for the Nesco meat slicer. Okay, find it and we'll write in Nesco. And here it is, I found it. So pull up a calculator, 117.90, multiply that by 0.85. 
$100 and 21 cents is after you pay payroll fees and minus the cost of $86 and 29 cents. $13. Cool. Exactly what we want to be. So let's go ahead and go into the website where you, you guys can uh, <coughs> access the course. This is uh, a course by DS Domination Company, short for Drop Shipping Domination, because we're pretty much dominate the drop shipping business. So I'll log in to my account right here. And we'll move down here. So when you first start, make sure you guys watch out here. Step one and step two. And uh, let me pull this up right here. So this course, this is a BS limited pro right here. This is what you guys get. Uh, uh, exactly step by step video on how to uh, sell on eBay using Fronix or Amazon. And of course, there's different levels, but I'll go into that in a uh, little bit later. So for 19.95, you get this right here. We click on this. Get module one to 19 and a lot of training. We we'll go to uh, module one and five first. Okay. When you first start this, watch this right here. Watch this video. Uh, module one, your mindset uh, moving forward. Watch this video. Setting up your eBay account in the U.S. Okay, watch that. If you're outside the U.S. You, know, you watch this right here. And listing your first item, really important uh, to watch this because it shows you guys exactly what to do step by step. Instruction, very important because that's, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so products to avoid, we have some listing down here, but there's more in the videos because uh, we don't want to sell these products because uh, we're not able to from the manufacturer, uh, you know, authorized dealership, and there's uh, high return rates. <clears throat> listing autonomy and adjusting your picture really important to, to have a, a great picture and we have the software to help you with that uh, module 6 speeding up your listing this shows you how to list item faster uh, title and spotting uh, details to show you guys how to find items uh, uh, now where you find items uh, critical information update really important you watch that International item location. This is for international people right here. Pitfalls to avoid. So why 18% fail? Because they don't follow the instruction in the course. Because there's always going to be what that fails in any business. Uh, so make sure you guys just follow the step-by-step -step instruction. And with, it's like any job. You know, what would they do uh, what, when you have a, a new job on the first day? Of course, you're going to have a, a person uh, that trains you and do that job correctly or else they're they're going to lose money or they're going to lose that business. Okay, so make sure you guys watch this and understand that full of the business completely before you guys start. So module 11, shipping from Amazon. Should you guys step by step to ship it, the item from Amazon. So remember uh, when you uh, first start this business, PayPal is on your money and so then you have to use that uh, your own money <clears throat> to buy the product and have a ship direct to the customer. And so continue your business established and PayPal is, uh, they also have a, a debit card which you can get so later on uh, you can use that debit card to buy the product for us straight directly uh, on Amazon. And so PayPal is right, right here where well, PayPal well, it's your money. I'll show you guys how to get that money faster. Uh, customer returns, how, how to do with that. Flipping eBay limits. So when you first start this business, you might have your uh, count on uh, certain limits uh, of how many items and how much you can sell. And we show you guys how to lift those limits. Multiple account on eBay. So we show you guys how to have multiple accounts on eBay right here. And module 16 to 19, we solve from problem orders. So uh, <clears throat> sometimes your items on Amazon right here they go up in price and then it goes out of stock and so we have a real um, right here to show you guys exactly what to do when uh, those situation arises and if it goes down in price then it doesn't really matter because we just make more money and caution 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 watch this very important 
case of success is the title, well, like we mentioned before, and we'll have the title about down here to help you with that. So eBay fee calculator right here is a website that uh, you can figure out your fees. Amazon taxes. So Amazon, in certain states, they will charge taxes, and we'll show you guys how to do with that. Uh, Amazon analyst is busting out this listing. Uh, uh, so uh, all you want to do is build up your inventory. It's the same with any business. You have to have uh, resell business. You have to have a lot of inventory and good products. So uh, you want to build it up. You know, have every day have a goal in mind of how much item you want to list a day. So my goal is I put like 10 items a day. So I write that goal in, and at the end of the month, I'll have uh, 300 items. So you always want to grow your business that way. Uh, and we have uh, another image, uh, excuse me, access to the scraper right here to help you guys even find more items right here. And then this spreadsheet right here to uh, help you with your uh, record your sales. The title builder will go into this one right here. And for example, we're looking for a high chair, right? So we'll write that into the high chair. And these are the keywords, and we just copy that and we'll put it onto the title. And let's go to have to go to the live training section. So DS Domination uh, Pro training is once uh, once a week. It's live, so rest, register for it and make sure you guys show up early because they ran out of space really fast. Uh, I recommend like showing up at least 15 minutes early. And then there's a special tax seminar replay right here. Watch that. And then there's also a uh, full training um, replays back here you want to watch. And we'll move back over here. And then uh, not that one. Wrong button. And then this, we also have a affiliate side right here, which is at what we are. We are just a reseller for this course. We'll, we'll show you uh, this course, and you sign up under us, we get a little bit of money. So this is uh, if you want to be a, a affiliate, a reseller, and you start doing this business right here, and uh, people also ask you how, how you're making money online, and uh, because you're buying things and stuff like that, right? And they show your checks. Uh, so you're gonna ask you and just tell them, hey, uh, uh, <clears throat> I, I sell on eBay, use Amazon supplier, and I'm also a reseller for this business right here. So I pull up the tier. So at the first level, you get 50%. So one uh, one person joins, you are it's already paid for for that uh, affiliate fee right there. So second level, you get 10%. Third level, you get 5%. So it goes down from there. So this is where you can build the other part of your business also. And that part right here, yes. and then of course this uh, DS domination, DS domination elite, DS domination unleashed, and DS domination monopoly. Uh, I'll explain a little bit. DS domination elite is uh, basically we get more suppliers, true and try suppliers that we can use to sell more items, and uh, we're able to sell it for uh, even a higher profit than what we find on Amazon. And, and then there's also uh, cash back and rewards. So on top of those profit, we also get cash back on top of this. This is a wonderful thing. And Unleash is even more of that. This is awesome. And Monopoly is we turn it everything upside down by selling on Amazon itself. I'm show you guys that step by step for uh, to do that. If you guys want to sell on Amazon, which is amazing. So I'm. Uh, uh, um, I'm all agreeing on this one. I mean, I have bought everything. And then now I'm moving on to selling on Amazon right here. So you guys are going to be seeing uh, um, yeah, more, more videos on Amazon. Uh, not moving on, but I was saying both, both places. And uh, what else are we covering? And oh, yeah, on the, if you're the elite, it's uh, $9, $99, 95 a month. And that's uh, on top of that pro. And then you, we also you also get that Amazon price checker down here, which is a great program. Um, I think that's covered for today. Oh yeah, yeah, I forgot, I forgot. I'm talking about the details. If you join, <coughs> um, if you join with uh, me uh, with this business, you also get get four videos training. So the first one is going to be the alternative product search technique. 
just another way of uh, searching for products even faster. And the second one is going to be the uh, training for low capital investment. So as I mentioned before, I recommend at least having at least about $500 in capital investment uh, to start a business, business, this business. But uh, with this training right here, you, I guess you can get away with less because we're going to show you guys how we find products that are low price on Amazon and sell for a higher price on eBay. And uh, number three is going to be the Amazon price and stock checker. So this is not on on a DS option course uh, is by signing up on, under I mean with me and starting the your business with me I'll show you guys a way you uh, check Amazon prices and check the stock uh, so it helps you with your business by Amazon and then number four is gonna be the finding hot product items right here I'll show you guys how to do that and yeah we made uh, we have time. I'll do a new training on this because it changes pretty much every day for our items or every month, every week. Okay, so we might minimize that. So that's what you guys get. And uh, uh, what else? And you guys can contact me usually on uh, Facebook. That's the fastest way. And then email. I'll move that up. And then Skype. Okay, so I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys later. Minlu, it's out. Bye bye.